That's John's second blade there. In the beginning, I just I had a hard time getting on board with buying artifacts. I have a, like a spiritual connection with what I find. And he got the book and I started reading. The more we talked about it, the more I could see that, you know, I'm, I'm all about Indiana history to begin with. And, I don't know how I got his number, but somehow I got his number and I proposed um, the video idea that I had. And he really liked it. He was biting on it, which he'd already done some videos, but um, this, what I had in mind was different. And I think he's seen that right off the bat. And, uh, <clears throat> you know, I talked to him how, you know, these kids today, they're, they're not going to buy a book. I mean, everything's digital. They're all going to be on their phones. They're going to be so, you know, you want to approach this like you want to, uh, you know, go visual. You want to go with music. You want to go with it. There's a certain flow. There's a certain psychology in the video. That's why I was kind of uh, letting him know that, you know, with music and with flow and a certain... Kind of a mystery to whatever, because that's what everybody wants these days. Everything's different. It's TikTok generation. I mean, you still want to appeal to the older time of people, but. We think faster, we process information, so you can tell a lot of story, you know, you can cram a lot of story into a small packet, so to speak, so.
Thank you. 